Hi, and welcome to your new Eclipse Supervisor account. Today, I'm going to take a few minutes to show you around your new reporting portal. First, click on Sign In, then enter the user credentials sent to you in your welcome email. If you're logging in for the first time, you will need to read and accept our terms of service. Then head to Reporting. The My Reports area is where you will see all of your reports and any report folders that you have created. The entire My Reports area can be collapsed using the button in the top right hand corner and then opened again using the toolbar on the left. Here you will also find the Add Report button. Then to access the Modify, Delete and Copy Report functions, simply tick a box with multiple reports being able to be ticked for the Copy and Delete function. To view a report, simply click on the report title. At the bottom of the screen you'll find the Open Report tab, where you can scroll and expand, and then simply click on a report to view it. In the bottom right you can select to have the portal automatically cycle through your open reports. The cycle time and whether you wish to include certain reports can be found in the Modify Reports section. And to turn this off, simply click the icon again. Now let's take a look at the report toolbar, where you'll find a number of different report and call control options. By clicking on the modify report button, this will bring up the settings window for the report you are currently looking at. Here you have your download center, where you can download via PDF, RTF, CSV, or even print the report. Next you have the snapshot option, where you have the ability to take a snapshot of live information to review later. The device filter, also found within the modify report screen, is where you can quickly filter which devices, groups and queues you would like to include by left clicking, or exclude by right clicking. Once selected, just simply refresh the report. The zoom level setting controls the display size of the report's content data. By clicking auto zoom, it will automatically size to fit the page. As a supervisor with an associated device, you will have the call control feature when select reports are set to real time. You can use the call control buttons on the report toolbar to perform various actions such as making new calls, as well as holding and answering calls. You can also left click on the report to give you control over other devices and agents. The report view type button allows you to select whether the report is displayed in either a detailed table view, one of two BLF arrangements or a chart. The date time filter allows you to immediately change the date or time range that is currently applied to the displayed report. You can also set this in the modify report section. To close the report you are looking at, simply click the cross in the right hand corner, but note this doesn't delete the report. To open it again at any time, click on the report name in the My Reports area. This is just a quick start to get you up and running.